the polling shows that ethics actually is up and top ranked in, in top three or four issues that Canadians say they're watching and worried about as it relates to the election. But does that translate into what we're seeing online? So it's definitely translating uh, in terms of uh, the increased volume or chatter around the Liberal Party. So going back to our last week view here, we can see that there's been a slight uptick um, in terms of overall conversation. And a big part of that is the conversation about uh, Mr. Bud's rejoining SNC okay. Lavalin, okay. Lavalin, et cetera. Um, our ethics, what's challenging a little bit when we build these queries is something like ethics is so broad that it's hard to define in a constant sure. manner. So if we were to, you know, take SNC, for example, as a topic and roll that into ethics, we'd have challenges to understand when the context is uh, ethically related and when the context is, uh, you know, related by infrastructure or right. related to the general business operations of S SNC Lavalin uh, inside Canada. So it gets a little bit more challenging and there are definitely nuances. When we're looking at the volume that we do look at, which is in the hundreds of thousands to low millions of posts a day across the country, uh, it's, it's hard for us to drill down further. So we, that's why we focus, we, do, we have that qualitative element to our analysis as well on a daily basis. So our social media brief comes out daily and we're tracking this, you know, from the morning, the second we get up in the morning, right through till when you get your analysis, so we're able to give that kind of color or that explanation as to why. And then we use the data to back up that qualitative analysis of what's going on. 